I'm gonna go make them more. Lonely hashtag. This is when we find a very lonely hashtag on Instagram and then we add to it. This one is hashtag hot Voldemort. Voldemort. <laughs> hot Voldemort. Hot Voldemort. Hot, hot Voldemort. Hot Voldemort. If you want to say the T. I say the T because I am not a Harry Potter fan. Uh, post your, ooh, post your photo that you're not makes a Harry, sense. You're not anti-Harry Potter uh, though. No, you I just, just, I'm indifferent to it. Yeah, you're, I'm a Lord of the Rings man. Post your he's photo too that old makes sense with that hashtag so it's it. not lonely anymore. Voldemort with a T. Hashtag hot ha. Voldemort. Okay, um, we are shooting this, what's happening right now, a day after the hot sauce swimming incident, I will call it, because it took me many hours to recover from from swimming in hot sauce. Did anybody I, take a I picture of you? I, I still recommend it. I, I took a picture. Oh, you took a picture of yourself. I That's took good. a I took a selfie for my <clears throat> Instagram, and then I talked myself out of posting it, just like I do with all of my Instagram posts for the oh, past eight years. Oh man, that would have been a good one. Um, Let's do that bit where we try to figure out if you what photo you're gonna use when you come back to Instagram. It doesn't look nearly as bad in the photo. Um, but uh, it was, it's pretty, it's pretty, it, it looks pretty bad. It's very splotchy, I mean. You gotta up the satch, man. The, the thing is, Do a satch I up. mean, there were red splotches all over my face and ears, and I, I knew that I was gonna uh, swim in hot sauce. Fun like this? In tapatio, I guess is what it was. I love how you just looked at your phone for a second. If <laughs> what are you supposed to unlock? When oh. I look at it. But you look like you were admiring your dog. <laughs> Well, that was that too. Are you you up in the sack? I'm going up the sack. Because that man. seems like cheating, but in, in real life, it was it was very splotchy and red. But my entire body, what I well, I ran out and I jumped in the shower and I turned this the um, heat on to whatever I think it I normally do, which was hot water. I didn't turn the. I can't even speak. I still haven't fully recovered. Um, I turned the water on to hot, and then I blasted my face to get the hot sauce <laughs> off, which is stupid. It made it even worse. And then it drained over my body into places that then started to get really hot down here. Woo! Not a good idea in, in, from any angle. Um, and then I proceeded to burn over my entire body, not just in the places where I was red, like sunburn. Um, it was like the felt like the worst sunburn ever over, over my entire body. But I like being warm. I much prefer that over being cold. So knowing that I was going to be okay, and I was putting ice packs on my ears and neck, um, and heat was radiating off of me, I was like, this is kind of cozy. But I do recommend not recommend it. Do I not? I don't recommend it. Um, but speaking of sunburn. We're gonna play some Pictionary here using, are you just looking at all of my photos? No, I'm trying to get fix that one. It's a little redder. My mm. ears look like they're gonna catch on fire. Let's modify it. Okay, and we'll, we will have already put it up for them to view. Put it up. That's the magic of editing. So we're gonna take turns using these cards and Pictionizing our backs with sunscreen, okay? Now Chase was telling us that this is a game that they used to play on the school bus, where you'd start drawing something in somebody's back, and they'd have to figure out what it was. I'm gonna turn around here. Anybody ever played that game? Is this a good spot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have okay. one, one, one play. So, all right, so this is just a gentleman's game. <laughs> of course, of course. You pull up your shirt, and another gentleman draws on it. Okay, and let's just say, going by feel alone, if I can, uh, I can guess what you're drawing. So you got to draw gonna, a card there. I'm gonna. I did. I'm gonna create a canvas here. Oh, not a canvas, but a. What do you call the thing that the painters use? A palette. Palette. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Three, two, one, zero. Okay. All right. So that it. An upside down corn cob pipe. So I'm just, this is just reinforcing one. Okay, you're circling something. Okay. Circling something? Yeah. And then over there, you're drawing something. You're drawing the bottom. You're drawing what I would say is 
like a roundish square rectangle and you're circling something. It's not a circle, really. Uh, is it a birthday cake? Boom. Is it a swimming pool? Is it an above ground swimming pool? <laughs> is it? This is gonna be hard because it looks like everything you said, but it's not that. Can you see it? Uh, yeah, I can kind of see it. Um, you gotta give me some more information, man. Uh, you can eat it. Um, but is it's that not how a Pictionary a works? Pie. You a just pie. no. Think about this. Dr draw something else. I have to face my head this way. That's a line. You're just drawing a line, and then a smiley face mm. that you can eat. Mm. A cookie. You can kind of do this. A, a tea. But that's not a help tea you. pot. This is gonna be really difficult. I, I, I give up. What is it? It's a hot dog. Oh, a hot, oh, I feel it now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, now, I let me try. You, I knew you'd get it once I told you. Okay, and I'm gonna use this to erase. I was trying to think about how you would be feeling it. Straddle your chair. And it's like, okay, because, you know, it's very difficult. I didn't want to give any confusing things. Like if I started doing a bunch of uh, stuff on the top, then, then I got a situation where, oh yeah. How long did it take you to recover from swimming with men? <laughs> I have 17, 18 minutes. Okay. I cooled down after oh, a while. I gotta get a clue here. Okay. I got it. All right. I think this should be pretty easy. Am I showing you my crack? Uh, if I look like this, then yeah. Okay. But I'm not gonna do that. Okay. What's that? Is it a flower? Uh, what is this? A circle. Yeah, that's right. Sun. Oh yeah! Oh right off the right off the bat. Home to the triple. <laughs> Look at it. Can you see, can you That's, that's why it. I got it because I looked at it in the Oh you no, looked at no, it? No, you no. can't No, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, okay. Uh, Alright, so now I'm gonna go again. Here we go. Let's pick up the pace. Let's pick up the energy. Come on. Now, come on. Let's cheer, mythical crew. No, no, don't. No, don't. Don't. No, 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 no. don't. Okay, here we go. Where you, where you want me here? Oh, that's good. Wherever, wherever you're comfortable. Why are these so double-sided-ish? All right. Three, two, one. Zero. <laughs> okay. Negative one. Okay. Negative two. Uh, Can you figure out what that is? Musical notes. No, really, really feel. It's it's a cue. You're drawing cues on my back. Nope. I can't feel in that part of my back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know what? I feel it. Well, okay. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. You know what? Can you push harder? At least I could get a deep tissue out of this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eyeball. Okay, that's the correct shape. And okay. then if I were to do, th do this to an eyeball, uh -huh. what would that be? Uh, poking out an eyeball. <laughs> nope. Uh, check mark in an eyeball. No, 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 no. It's the shape of an eyeball, but if you add this thing to an eyeball, it changes what it was. This, and then this, and then this, and I've done a bunch of this. Fish, fish, yep. aquarium. And a, yeah, uh, school, school, school of fish. School of fish. Yes. School, Look at that. School of fish, school of rock. Okay. I got that one. Okay. Oh, yeah. It smells like summer. Okay. All right. You still got some. Go this way. Ang angle that way. There you go. That's it. That's it. Okay. One side of a tree. Oh yeah. It's a Christmas tree. Yes! See, I'm so good at this. Yeah, that's the key. Okay. Ready? All right, now really try this time, okay? I believe in you. I'm really trying every time. You're the one who's not trying. Okay. No, that's too hard. 
Oh, that's too hard. That's the only two left we have? Oh, man. Okay. Two words. First word. Oh, gosh. Eyeball. Football. No. Fish. The angle's different. Uh, it's the top, it's the cap. It's a toupee. Yeah. Uh, but there's a little something there. A little something coming out in there. Uh, a crab? No, it's very simple. It's this, and this, and this, and then S this. Smiley face. Clowns, smiley face. Mm, nope. Okay. It's a smiley this face. This was tough. Dot, dot okay, I'm going to give you, it's two words. This is the second word. Okay. I got to get more on my hand. Here we go. That is a bell curve. Yeah, oh, it's a what? A bell curve. Yep. Yeah, yeah, but what's bell? It? Yep. And bell. Back to this. Bell's the second word. Bell bottoms. Bell's the second word. Okay. Bottom bell. Yep. What is this? Uh, C Kristen Bell. No. <laughs> what is what is this? I'm drawing. What could be this shape right here? What kinds of things are this shape? That are the first word and something that ends with bell. <laughs> <laughs> cowbell. More cowbell. What is this, this shape? What things could be this shape right here? This what, shape. It's just it's just a half of a circle. It's a moon. Yep, right. Moon bell. What kinds of things are shaped like half circles when looked at from the side? That are the first word and something that ends with bell. That's two words. Sometimes it has things coming out of it here on the side. Maybe all the way on the top. School bell. I don't know. <laughs> Just name things that are shaped like half circles when drawn on backs. Half circles when drawn on back. Um, nut button. Just a moon. <laughs> Nothing else. Give me another hint. What's it? What's word? What letter does it start with? Okay. Before, Put that on my back. Before it. The letter on my back. T. <laughs> Yeah. Top bell. I gave you the second letter. I'm giving it to you right now. <laughs> You're spelling it on my back? Yep. Do that again. You're so dainty with your letters. Make them big. <laughs> Make them bigger. E. Is that an E? What else could that be? A. Ta. 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 Tall bell. Yeah. The thing that starts with T-A and is the first word of a two-word phrase that ends with bell is shaped like this. <laughs> what could it be? What could that be? This is turning into one of those moments that people make fun of me for for years. Okay, and here's the third letter. Here's the third letter of that T-A. Not Michael Pufty. What is that, a G? <laughs> I can't feel on my back. That's why I'm yeah, so good at getting you, massages. I think, I think you might be back dead, man. Look. <laughs> what could that be? A C. Yeah, okay. Tack. Tack bell. <laughs> Here's the thing. Taco you, bell. Yeah. <laughs> you think he's joking. You think he's doing it for entertainment. Well, it is very entertaining. But he's not doing it for entertainment. You wanna go to Taco Bell? Chase gave me the answer. <laughs> oh gosh. Put that on a t-shirt is no longer just a fun saying. It's our new fan art merch program. Go to amazon.com slash mythical to find out how you can submit your design for a mythical tee.